Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome to another video and welcome back to Planet Coaster. Um, now last time we were putting in all this new shit, I think we put in the Biodome Coaster here. Yeah. Um, so we, we put in this new stuff in the last episode. Um, either that or I did this in my own free time, I can't remember. It's been a, it's been a while since I've, uh, since I've played the game, uh, as well as, uh, recorded an episode of it, so I don't really know what I accomplished, um, in the last episode, um, but one thing I want to talk about before we get in and do anything today, um, it's the fact that, like, my game is running real slow at the moment, and it's not because of my computer, it's not because of my hardware, um, I've heard multiple reports saying that this game isn't extremely well optimized, uh, which means that the game is going to run, uh, it's not going to run as well as it could. Like right now I'm running close to 30 FPS and I would prefer to have it closer to 50 or 60, um, but the game isn't very well optimized. Um, so it's running at this lower frame rate, which is why I'm not going to take it up to a higher speed. Like maybe times two is like the max that I'll go. Uh, times three is just going to look like garbage. Um, but yeah, like I, I, I just wanted to bring that up because, um, oh, geez, this ride, this ride was doing so well. Like why, why you got to break down? Um, How do I deal with it? Anyway, I was saying, like, I just wanted to bring that up because, um, I understand that, like, people get upset when, um, people get upset that, uh, when videos aren't at, like, 60 frames per second and they're not running extremely well. And, uh, I have lowered my graphical settings as well to try and counter it. It has done absolutely nothing. I have lowered my graphical settings... Um, I've lowered a bunch of different things. It's done almost nothing. Um, but I don't want to revert back because, you know, then it'll be a bit worse, you know. And I'm just trying to make it look as good as I possibly can. What was I going to do? I was going to hire a, a mechanic, that's right, because I wanted to hire another one. Um, ew, I stepped in sick. That litter is disgusting. Uh, well, that sounds like a problem. Um... What was I going to say again? I, I don't remember. That's just all I wanted to say. I just wanted to say that my game isn't going to run as well. And I bet that anybody you're watching, the game isn't going to run very well once their park gets big enough and there's a lot of assets and everything within it. Um, I'm willing to bet that their games are running the same way. Um, because that's just how it is with this game. Um, I'm sure they'll update it in the near future that will allow it to... Um, that will allow it to be better optimized. It's just, as of right now, it's not tremendous, it's not tremendously optimized. Which isn't a tremendously big deal, because you can still play the game and still have an enjoyable experience. It, it's just, it would be nice if it was optimized to the point where I don't have to worry about, you know, it lagging out on me. Or, you know, I, I, I have to avoid the, uh, the cheetah speed or the triple speed, whatever you want to call it. Look how many people are here in this section. Like, it is just a giant clusterfuck of people. That's insane. Why are there this many people here? I mean, it's not a bad thing. It's just, you know, it's like, all right. I mean, like, you know, there's a lot of a, there's a lot of people. Um, entertainers, janitors, vendors, mechanics, work rosters. What was that one tab I went to where I was able to I was able to go in and view all of the staff that I had was this one no Oh wait, here we go. I can go in here and it's uh it's all separated and everything cuz I I want to go in and I want to make sure that these guys are happy working for me so that they don't quit. Um, because have you got as you guys have seen, I've had a lot of people quit, uh, especially in the last episode. Most of them vendors, um, 
And that's a problem because I, I can't have them doing that, you know. I have to have them working. I need all of the buildings that I have in place to ensure that my guests have the best time. Because even with all of this stuff, they're not having the greatest time. You know, they're uh, they're upset about the, uh, the vomit all over the place and they're upset about the litter problem. Which, I mean, is understandable to an extent uh, because... I mean, I don't have a whole heck of a lot of janitors to cater to the 5,620 people that are here. But at the same time, I have put trash bins everywhere. So, you know, I mean, I, I'm just saying. Like, you know, you know, it's not really my fault that, uh... Not really my fault that, uh, people don't use them. It is my fault, however, if my, don't, if my janitors don't cater to the problem um now as for this area down here jesus taking me forever to get down here um could have just zoomed out and would have been much quicker as for this area down here i do want to put a ride down here um i don't know if it'll be like an extremely small roller coaster like the ones i i have had or if it'll be a thrill ride of some sorts or even a gentle ride most likely it's going to be a thrill ride and if it's going to be a thrill ride I have a feeling that I'll be able to fit in too. Um, because the rides aren't tremendously big. Well, most of them aren't. And for that reason, I, I, I think that I can fit in more than one. Um, like, have I put this ride in before? Yes, I have. Um, so, we're getting rid of it. It would be nice if it would tell me if I've put in these rides before. Because I like having variety. Um... That's all right. That's okay. Okay, so we're going to put in... I haven't put in the Screaminator, right? Maybe I have? The Screaminator 3. So I've put this in two times already. Well, I didn't realize that. Eventually, I'm going to have to start, you know, putting these in in multiple places as the park grows bigger, but I don't want to do it right now because the park in perspective is still kind of small. I mean, we've, we've used up about a third of our space closer to a half. So, you know, it's, I'm not quite ready to have that happen yet. Oh, come on. It altered the terrain, the, the screaminator. What the hell, man? Come on. Fucking. Oh, What's this button? No, push. Yeah, get back down. Get back down. I could alter this. But I kind of like how that is. Um, I don't really want to mess with it. Get back down. Get back down there. I don't need none of this shit right now. I'm trying to put in a thrill ride. And I've considered that maybe I have too many rides uh, at the moment and that like people just can't get to them because there are so many of them. But at the same time, it's like, I kind of want to put them in anyway, because, like, why the hell not? Come on. I, mean, I guess I didn't really fix this up here, but it's kind of hard to look at it in perspective, you know, whether or not you're... Whether or not you're, uh, doing enough. Uh, I was going to put in this one. Do you work now? No. Why doesn't that surprise me? I have to do a bit more down here. God, game, don't lag out on me like that. Lag spikes. Ooh, that's gonna be tough to get a path up. Or yet two paths. Um, it's all right though. What? Come on. All right, let me try and get a smaller ride in here. If I put this in the forge, I don't think I have, but it's too big. 360 power. Oh, this all of this terrain is fucked up. You know what? You know what I should have done? I should have just, I should have just control Z'd. Now I have to go back, adjust all the terrain, back to when it, I put the screaminator down. There we go. There we go. I think it's fine now. I think it should work okay. Maybe not, actually. 
Did putting that down fuck with the terrain? Yes, it did. Okay. I just wanted to see. How are you still not working? And you know what? I've put you in already. I just realized that. But, but, oh, wait. Here we go. Oh, there's a tiny little sliver there. I saw it. There we go. There we go. Got it. The Forge 4? Wait a minute. I have not put in four of those. I have not put a single one of those in here. And even if I have, I haven't put in four of them. Don't lie to me, game. Don't fucking lie to me. I mean, I... Maybe it's just doing that randomly. I have no idea. It is weird, though, that it would do that. Just kind of randomly. Whatever. Doesn't matter. It's fine. God damn. I, I hate the camera rotation. Because sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. Because you have to use the middle mouse wheel. Uh, and it you have to click down on it. And sometimes it chooses to do it. Other times it doesn't. You know, I could use the arrow keys, but I don't really feel like doing that. I like having, you know, the mouse under my control. Because it controls everything else. Uh, but we need to place an entrance. And we're going to place this relatively close to the path. As close as we can get it. Because why bother trying to... Um, you know, make it longer than it needs to be. Oh, no. Oh, no. Really? Are you fucking... No. No, 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 no. There, there you go. There you go. Are you good? Can we do this now? Where, where's my thing? Q. Can I... Oh, that is ugly. Oh, no. Oh, that is super ugly. I can't even handle that. I cannot even handle that. No, 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 no. Fuck, man. You know what? Wouldn't it be cool, actually, if I tried... Can I, like, narrow what I have? Like, can I narrow this thing? Yeah, I can. Wouldn't it be cool? Actually, that does absolutely nothing. What if I... What if I did this? Oh, God. This is not turning out the way I thought it would. What? I can't... Oh, fuck. All right. I gotta control Z my way out of this. Okay. All right. We're good. We're Gucci. You know what? I think what I'm going to do is can I, I'm going to keep control Zing. Uh, yeah, I'm going to place my entrance in a different spot. Like right there. That'll work. And then my exit can go right here. Just to avoid this divot right there. That divot right there. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's how we're doing it. So we're fucking doing it. And then we go up like this, and it works. It's an extremely long queue path for a ride that won't get nearly as much attention as what the, what the length of the queue path is calling for. But at the same time, it works perfectly fine. I don't really care. And that works fine as well. Goody. Goody, goody, good. I do need some stuff to decorate the uh, the Q path, and I think trees would be the most suitable thing because trees. I'm gonna open this up and I'm going to open it to the public, but I'm gonna start putting in trees and such. Try and decorate the path a little bit so that people are satisfied. Uh, let's get a different tree going over here. I know I put in a lot of the same trees all over the place, but they work. Like, this is, uh, this region I'm in is very mountainous, very uh, densely populated by forests and everything. And these trees just work so well that I can't, like, not put them in. Um... 
and then this side we're gonna keep with the theme with the whole alpine fir trees thing are these gonna end up floating in the air if I put them in yes they are um, so we're not we're not doing that because fuck that um, okay get 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 out you you're um, your operations no you're gonna do any load because you hardly have anybody here it would take ages for a ride to get going if we had to wait for half the load same with you more people need to get down here the hell god there's a load of shit down here there's roller coasters there's um there are thrill rides there's a coffee shop well, there's loads of shit going on down here, and people just aren't acknowledging it. And maybe it's because, like, I have, like, one path to get everywhere that people have to follow. So it only makes sense that, um, that it would take this long for people to get down here. Um, man, that's, that queue is kind of ugly, but... I mean, not like what's surrounding it, it's just... The way it kind of curves like that, but I can't really change it because uh, that's just how it is. Um, man, people love this ride. The sundial ride, whatever it is. Guest needs happiness, energy, and hunger. Meep sauce? What the fuck is meep sauce? I don't know what that is. I'm just gonna go ahead and go to this. Yeah, good. You're taking any load. That's good. That's good. That's how uh, rides operate in the real world, right? They take any load that they get and they uh, put as many people on there as they can. They don't just go when they have half. I mean, I understand it's like a minimum, but if you have one person in line for a ride. You want it to still go. You want that person to still... Uh, you want the, that person to still be able to ride the ride and, the, uh, and pay money to ya. To ya. Oh, wow. I did put in the 360 power ride earlier. I didn't realize that. Wow. Okay, okay. All right, there's a lot of people here. It's, uh, there's a very large amount of people here. Uh, I don't know exactly what they're all doing. Are they all just, you know, standing around puking over each other? I mean, like, that is a lot of people. It's a lot of people. For that general reason, <laughs> Like, this ride, this NASA ride, is, like, awesome. Like, that's the best roller coaster I have put into this park, by far. Come on, man. And the queue isn't even that long for it. The queue is not even that long for it. Eventually, that this traffic that is down here is going to move over here and thus over here um it's just it's gonna take some time because you know obviously that's how that's how things work you know they take time and eventually people will realize that there's that this area down here has more to offer i do want to put some shops in and like this area and down here and everything so that there's more of an incentive to come down here uh, but we're not going to do that right now what we are going to do is we are going to Put that on the uh, the slowest speed, and uh, we are going to end the episode. And I know I didn't accomplish a whole lot this episode, but I um, but it was it was good to like uh, kind of just talk about various things within the game, um, even if I only put in one ride and I just changed the uh, the wages of some vendors and everything. Um, I feel like we accomplished enough. Um, and this is kind of how I gauge the rest of the series going, because this is what it what would happen in City Skylines, is I wouldn't accomplish a whole lot in one episode, because I can't, because, um, because of the way things are. 
I mean, if I really wanted to, I could have extended this path way down here and put in three fuck fucking roller roller coasters and then be done with the episode. But I want to take time with this. People aren't even down here in this region yet. I I need to wait. You know, it's like I can't I can't rush this. Um, hopefully, you understand. Um, if you guys are enjoying this series, uh, let me know uh, by commenting down in the comment section below. Like the video and share it with your friends. It lets me know you want to see more of any game series I do here on the channel. Um, link down to the game is in the, descri the description box down below. Um, it's $45 on Steam. It did not go on sale during the Steam Autumn Sale. But it might during the Steam Winter Sale, which I heard, according to rumors, is starting on December 22nd. So... If you want to wait till then and see if it goes on sale, by all means, go ahead. If you want to buy it now, by all means, go ahead. If you don't want to buy it at all, it's perfectly fine. I'm not telling you to do anything. I'm just letting you know. If you, if, you, if you want it, the link is right there in the description box. And uh, if you guys enjoyed the video, give it a like. If you didn't, tell me why in the comment section below. Subscribe to my channel for more gaming content. I play all sorts of games on my channel. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you very much. And I'll talk to you later.